Ladies and gentlemen, Manchester City uh, midfielder Rodri has called out Arsenal for a weak mentality going away at the Etihad playing for a draw. I got the video for you guys right now. I'm going to play it for you guys. Let me know what you think. I think this is an absolute piece of baloney, but we need to discuss it as he is going in on Arsenal today after winning the Premier League title. Let's play it for you. You do it. What does the manager do? What do you guys as players, what sort of demands do you put on each other? I think, to be honest, it's in here. It's uh, the mentality. Great players are all over the leagues, all over the, the clubs. Uh, Arsenal also, they deserve of us. They, they, they went there, they did an un unbelievable season, but I think the difference was in here. When they come here, when they, they face us here in the, in the Etihad, I, I saw them, ah, these guys, they don't want to beat us. They just want to draw, you know, and that mentality, I think we didn't, we wouldn't do it the same way. And we catch it, we catch it. And at the end, if you give us one point, we will win the last seven, eight games, even though how tough it is. So I think it's terms of mentality. How do you do Okay, first of all, I think he's talking absolute shit. He's talking absolute shit. It's not true at all. It's not true at all. He's just talking a lot of baloney, talking about Arsenal's mentality, this and that, all this BS. It's a bunch of BS. And let me explain to you why it's a bunch of BS. First of all, he's saying their mentality is the reason why Son misses a one-on-one. -on -one. He's saying their mentality is the reason why guys are just in the title running against them. Teams like Nottingham Forest, teams like Spurs, they, these players are missing these chances. Their mentality made the, the opponent miss these clear-cut opportunities. Is that, is, that, is, that, is that accurate? Their mentality made these opponents miss those opportunities. Interesting. Interesting to say the least. They're, they're absolutely talking shit. Well, he's talking shit when he says that. Because he surely the great mentality, these two chances got missed. And, and this is what helps them secure the league title. Also, when he talks about the mentality, when he talks about when he talks about the mentality, when he talks about, oh, we, we did this, we did that, we did everything else. One thing you got to realize is this season versus the top teams, this season, this season versus the top teams, the top teams in the Premier League, where was their mentality there? Where was their mentality versus Arsenal away? Did, did, they, did they win that game? I'm pretty sure, if I'm not mistaken, Man City, they lost the game to, they lost the game to, what do you call it? Uh, they lost a couple, a couple of those big games this season and they, and they got a draw. Am I wrong? Am I wrong? So when it, when it comes to Liverpool, where where is it? Where is it? Let's let's find this. Let's find this. So Anfield, what happened there? One one. You got a draw, right? Did you win that game? Where was your mentality there? Then they, uh, you, they actually played you off the park. You played for that draw. Then you have a situation where when you came to the Emirates, what happened when you came? What happened? What happened when you went to? Uh, what happened when you went to? What do you call it? Chelsea's ground. You got a four four draw. Similar, we got a draw also at Chelsea's ground, but I'm just saying, like, and also when you went to Arsenal's ground, what happened there? You 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 lost, right? So this is the team that has picked up zero wins, zero wins versus the title rivals, zero victories versus the title rivals, and has picked up a possible one point out of six versus Arsenal this season, where we've picked up four, and he's challenging our mentality. Let's hear this bollocks again. What does the manager do? What do you guys as players, what sort of demands do you put on each other? I think, to be honest, it's in here. He's saying mentality. It's uh, the mentality. Great players are all over the leagues, all over the, the clubs. Uh, Arsenal also, they deserve of us. They, they, they went there, they did an un unbelievable season, but I think the difference was in here. When they come here, when they... they... I can't. He's just chatting shit. He's literally chatting shit. He's saying when they came here, we played for a draw, blah, 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 blah. He's criticizing the way we play. He does this all the time. He criticized Morocco, how they played against Spain when they beat him. He criticized all the teams when they beat him. But you know when it's when it's Diego Simeone, his former manager, when it's Diego Simeone and his former manager, what does he do? He's bum licking him off. What is what does he say? What does he say? He says, Man City star Rodri uh, fires back at Atletico Madrid boss, says, oh, uh, over claims that nobody is defending in the Premier League. 
he 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 was talking about this just a couple a couple of weeks ago, saying that nobody does nobody does this in the Premier League, and he was speaking about how he was speaking he was criticizing Arsenal for being pragmatic, but sometimes brags about his former manager Diego Simeone and how defensive they are and how well defensive how well they've been defensively. It's mental, it's mental. But yeah, let me just bring you back to my main point. This is my main point. And uh, in the Etihad, I, I saw them. Okay. The result at the Etihad did not determine if we beat Man City to the league or not. We got a draw. One point at the Etihad is a good point. What costs us the league is subsequently dropping points later in the title race to then lose the league also dropping points to the likes of fulham dropping points to the likes of aston villa and dropping points to the likes of west ham for you to go back to a game versus yourselves and say that is where the league was won or lost is just categorically wrong it is wrong you don't win or lose the league by a by one-off game versus man city or else we would have won the league because we picked up more points from you guys. We would have won the league because we also picked up more points from Liverpool. But it's not one based on the two games that you play against your title rivals. It's one over the 38 games and the consistency that is need to be played over those 38 games. This is what he's doing right now. He's trying to big up his own people and somewhat belittle Arsenal. But it's not that's not the mentality. If they're trying to say, oh, Arsenal came to the uh, to the Etihad and didn't want to seriously go at them. Maybe we did not want to lose the, the the game because if we would have went at you, we would have left ourselves exposed and potentially conceded a lot of goals. We know what our strength is and we play to our strength. We play to our strength. And I think guys like Rodri are going to continue to play this rhetoric. They don't want to beat us. They just want to draw, you know. And They don't want to beat us. They just want to draw. Well, you couldn't beat us at the Emirates. You couldn't beat Liverpool at Anfield. If I'm not mistaken, you couldn't beat Chelsea at their ground. And this season, you didn't beat Aston Villa at their ground either. So it's a situation where maybe if you got if if, if you got a draw in one of those places, we, we you could have won the you could you could have won the league by more points. Also, if maybe if we got a draw in some of the places where we ended up uh, ended up uh, losing, we could have ended up uh, getting get winning the league. I think this whole argument is BS. He's literally just trying to trigger people by saying whatever he can. I don't believe he generally believes what he's saying. Rodri's just talking shit at this point. He's talking shit. And also going back, the chances that were missed by some of the teams, the opportunities, there was there was clear opportunities that, that could have taken off people. And also the amount of points that we picked up. We picked up 40 points out of a possible 20 in our first 20 games. In our next uh, 18 games, we picked up 49 points. We did what we had to do in the second half of the season. It's just that home game versus Aston Villa and some poor results throughout the season cost us and you pipped us to the league by small margins. Don't sit here and try to say it's your mentality. Bullshit. Anyways, I'm out of here, people. Let me know what you guys think. Do you agree with Rodri or do you agree with me? Either way, leave a comment down below. Hit the like on the video and I'm out, people. Peace.